Hi, I'm here to talk to you about the Red Puddle Co 13-2 Explorer. The 13-2 Explorer is the ultimate adventure board. 13 foot 2 overall in length, just 30 inches wide, almost 6 inches thick at 5.9, and with 350 litres of volume, this board just eats up distances. It's really popular here at the SUP company, even more popular with our customers. The number of these boards that we've sold is tremendous. But let me take you through it from the front to the back. So you've got the Ram mount, brand new for 2017 this year. Great versatile system. So whether you want to fit GoPro, GPS, fishing rod holder, the full shebang you can with the Ram mount system. The nice thing with it there on the 13.2 Explorer is you've not got one, you've not got two, but you've got three. So you've got the one at the very nose of the board, one halfway down here through the cargo net, and then you've got one on the rear bungee system that we'll come to in just a second. But first off, front cargo net, longest one on the Red Paddle Co range, so heaps and heaps of gear under here. You've got to bear in mind that at 350 litres of volume, you can carry 150 kilos plus on this board easy, so load it full of kit. It's not a problem at all, it's not going to be phased in the slightest. We're coming back on from behind the bungee system here, nice diamond cut, crocodile skin textured deck pad, really comfortable underfoot, but loads and loads of traction where you need it. Three handles, which we find really helpful when getting the board in and out of the water here at the pontoon that we've got behind the shop. It just helps you break surface tension with the outboard handles. But your main carrying handle is the padded one in the center, but those two outboard ones are also padded as well. And that diamond cut crocodile skin deck pad runs all the way down to the back. And then you've got another bungee system on the back there. And then you've got these three traction, uh, three traction pads that just help secure the luggage and make sure that it's not going to go anywhere whatsoever. And on the very tail of the board, you've got a really good carry handle as well. So we flip the board over now, and then you'll see something really interesting about the Explorer. And the same goes for the 12.6, slightly smaller, slightly wider than this model. But you've got a nose runner on the front, just helps engage the nose, stops any wayward uh, tracking issues that you might have in crosswinds. You've got two more runners there on the back, either side of the US fin box. Again, to stop any tail drift, side to side movement there, and just help with tracking overall. But a big improvement in this year is the FCS2 9 inch touring fin. Really, really nice addition to the board. It has improved tracking no end and therefore making you even more efficient and the board so far as well. And finally, a nice addition to the 13.2 Explorer and has stiffened it up no end. Given in, bear in mind it's a 5.9 inch thick board, the RSS batten has just make it around 10 to 15% stiffer yet again, but a really nice addition to the board and a great touch by Red Paddle Co. Overall, one of our favorites. Thanks for taking the time to watch our video. If you've got any questions about what you've seen or stand up paddle boarding in general, please pick up the phone, give us a call or drop us an email. We'll be happy to help and get you on the water this summer. Thanks again.